All right, time to continue our quest in Icewind Dale. Yes. And now we are exploring the Tower of the Severed Hand. I think I made it through the first, yeah, the first three floors, I believe. So which means now we're gonna have to ex continue exploring some more. Because I know this area in particular has got my interest. But I think I have to find an alternate stair source on the second floor, or on the third floor to go back down. A reasonable request. I think it's this will allow me to go back down. Question, who exactly was damaging these guys? start. Not a bad way to start. Thank you, Edward, for having your fire sword handy. What's this? That's a short sword. Oh, this does more damage than the fire sword? Hmm. Very peculiar that it would do that. More to the point, it gives him a minus one to armor as well. Hmm. That's very interesting to say the least. So you know what? I'll keep it. It's a keeper. I will assist. May I help? Let's see what sort of item I got this time. So that will take me back down to the first level. So I'm gonna keep an eye out for traps as well. Steal 
That's a lot of bladed dudes right there. May I help? How may I best serve? How about a little fireball? You know, how about one more fireball for good measure? Jesus Christ, Jared! No, you know, had you done your fireball the first time, like I asked you to? I shall do my best. This would not be happening. Leaving her alone, dude. Leave her alone. Oh, Jesus Christ. Again, Jared? Do you not know how to do your job, dude? Ay, ay, ay. A reasonable request. Give me a target and I'll smash it. Yeah. Yeah. I am ready. I suppose I got some time to kill. Okay. Quick agree. Oh. I'm ready to do adventuring and stuff. Bloody job. Bring it 
shame that we must resort to violence. Looks like I'm gonna get a lot of killings. God, you guys are completely stupid. I'm not playing babysitter to you guys, you know. Melee layers I'm not so worried about. It's everybody else that worries me. one less damage, but you know what? That extra firepower might do the trick. Ridiculous. Oh. oh, he's getting close to leveling up. I am ready. Saber calls me. I shall do my best. What I 
shall do my best. A reasonable request? Go over here. I'll do my best. Certainly. Agreed. I'm not quite ready to go to the fourth level. I still got some exploring to do. I will do as you ask. I want to wait 
back this way. I am off. None of my characters are proficient with crossbows. Saber calls me. Oh, what's this? Actually, this would be an opportunity to uh, start selling some items. I will do as you ask. I will do as you ask. once in a while.
guys are uh, so whiny about it. Shadowed robe. Yeah, let's take a look. Ooh, this does bring down the armor too. I might need this because of. Labor calls me. Not because of the ice monsters we might come across later. And the necromancer's rope can go. So I guess none of us can buy the helm of the trusted defender. Huh. I don't think it looks like what I'm equipped with. Nail yeah, plus one. Well. Well. I guess I could buy it. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so I guess I could go ahead and uh, sell it then. This stuff is so expensive. Well, this is all a lot of stuff that I sold. All right. Yes, a reasonable. I shall do my best. Well, I suppose we could, uh, head out. Hello, welcome to the stream. Uh, how's it going? I shall do my best.
Or you're, or you're playing as a sorcerer? Yeah, I'll be openly honest here. Magic users tend to usually make things more difficult. In fact, I recall a story of a... I don't know if you're... Well, well if you're interacting with me, that doesn't exact, that doesn't constitute as being bored. But anyways, as I was saying, I remember people saying that uh, they played the very first Final Fantasy game with four white mages and, get this, actually beating it. So it just makes me think, uh, what exactly are you doing right to uh, achieve this goal? Well, anyways. Well, actually, if you think, uh... I was gonna say, if I was the cure for insomnia, I'd be one rich person. But I digress. Just saying. Uh, don't... Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna get too judgmental. I mean, it doesn't matter how you say a sentence, as long as what you say makes a sense. Request. I will do as you ask. So where was I going? Oh yeah, now we gotta go to the fourth floor now, because I think I'm done conquering the first three. So floor four, here we come. Let's see here. I'm just gonna have to wait a little bit because I wanted to... Ooh, someone's here. Agreed. For blade and faith. Let me see what his deal is. I have defended the hand of the Seldarine at all costs, and will continue to do so. Cursed it with unknife. My duty remains clear. I stand guard against those who would defile what remains of Seldarine's hand. I will be the judge of that. Speak your intentions clearly. Perhaps you are not the miscreants I had thought you were. If what you say is true, it is my duty to aid you if it will further the ways of the Seldarine. I am Lathias Enerel, blade singer of the Seldarine. Some say blade singers are the elite of elven warriors. Trained from an early age in the ways of weapons, magic, and diplomacy, blade singers carry out the elven ways in words and action. Go on. When life proposed prospered in the Seldarine's hand, uh, it was my duty to defend the cause of the Seldarine. When the time of our darkest hour approached, I swore to protect Laurel and the hand until I had no more blood to be spilled. Uh, to do any less would disgrace my kind. And even in death, I still serve. Sorry, wrong game. For many days, I fought alongside my brothers and sisters. Score after score of orcs and goblins fell as my blade sank through the air. Although I saw nothing but the color of my enemy's blood, it tasted like Skittles. We were losing ground. When we realized the fall of the hand was inevitable, we were forced to take desperate action. Saheni Tower was our most prized tower. Inside were the chambers when where we crafted our finest weapons and art artifacts. We would not let our magics fall into the hands of the Horde or the surrounding lands would suffer for centuries after the hand fell. Mm -hmm. A desperate plan was created that would ensure this would never happen. All the artifacts within Sehanin Tower was... were set to release their magic so that the lower would destroy its... or tower, excuse me, would destroy itself. All the... What was that? Oh, yes. Before these energies were released, however, we planned to lead as many of the orcs and goblins as we could into Sehanin. The plan required one who was willing to lead the orcs and goblins into the tower. We drew lots. One, would, one who would know the sacrifice had to be made, one willing to die. So I had to prepare the lots. I decided that it would be me. I drew the short one. I would make the sacrifice. My duty was clear. I was going to say, yeah, reading your comment here about uh, being a solo sorcerer, uh, one word of advice, make sure that, make sure that your character is ranged if you run out of magic, because that's what I have to do with my mage, because he's not proficient with, uh, because the weapon selection is very limited. When the time came, the horde pushed me as I climbed to the top. As my enemy stormed the room at the pinnacle of the tower, I fought with blade and faith for the last time. I told my wife and child I love them dearly. With the wall at, the, at my back and the room filled with orcs and goblins, I heard the first explosions from the base of the tower and smiled. 
Okay, I can understand that you were willing to fight to your very last breath, but there's a point where it's like, you know what, dude, you're doing too much. Um, the sling, huh, how can I put this? If you actually, at the very beginning, at the very beginning, when you create your character, if you put the proficient for the sling, that actually does more damage and you don't get penalized for it. I died and I knew I had died, but I awoke. That was when I saw myself, not as an elf blade but a twisted undead monster. My God, I look good. I just wish I hadn't died so I could keep this beautiful face, but I digress. Something brought my body back into this form, but had left my mind intact. So here I am. I stand, I am standing. Yeah, let's try that again. So here I am, standing before what was once known as Sehenin Tower, a monster perhaps, but one still thing remains the same. My duty to myself and the hand of Seldarine. Uh, unfortunately, I have not seen Lorel in some time. I know that during the fall of the hand, he and his wizards locked themselves atop Labellus Tower. They sought a way to save our people through magic, but from looking around, something must have gone terribly wrong. Seek a way into Labellus Tower. Perhaps you'll find an answer there. Oh, this again. Alright. What is your will? Okay, so that's our next objective. We gotta find a way inside Labellus Tower. Okay, so that is our way in, but we can't go in just yet. Because I think what I have to do is conquer the other towers first. That'll get me inside. And I think it doesn't matter what order you take the towers in. At least, I don't think. And I think this is also a bit of a safe haven, too. place. Hmm. Bustling with activity. Actually, there was actually one thing I was going to show you. I was going to say, if you take a look at my mage character, if you take a look at his proficiencies, that's what I was trying to get at earlier. If you, if you, uh, if you put your proficiencies for dagger and sling, or any other bladed weapon, you should be alright. But keep in mind, though, that mages and magic users Quickly cannot wear armor. Certainly. Unless you decide to dual class. Huh. I'll start to tell Adventurers? Hey, I never thought anyone of the living would have made it up these parts of the hand ever again. Uh, nevertheless, let me present myself to you. The name's Talanus. Talanus Songbender. Singer extraordinaire, master of the eight string mandolin, lover of beautiful women, teller of grand tales, and best of all, minstrel to the hand. So, in other words, so in other words, you're a weirdo. No offense, but that's just my take on it. I love I love answer number two and three. Impressive reputation, Talanis. So, how much of it is true? A singer, huh? I'll be the judge of that. Sing me a song, minstrel. You know what? Oh, I haven't got... I don't think I've gotten those items yet, but we'll see. I, as odd as it may seem, a few of us retain some semblance of our former selves after Laurel cast a spell. Everyone else has either gone mad or is intent to killing on everything they see. Let me entertain you with a song and perhaps this will answer some of your questions. Would you care for an old tale about Laurel? Perhaps a sad tale about the union we have with our dwarven neighbors. I think you have to listen to both. Let's do Laurel first. My tale of Laurel is this. In time of growth did the elves deem so that a haven in the north be made. They searched for one strong of mind, strong of will to bear this burdensome task. Dude, you're not even, dude, there's no rhyme in here. How can you be a minstrel if you don't rhyme? Well, anyways. Though the wizards were many, the intelligence all had one of wisdom they found. Laurel shined above all. Right did he across frozen lands, ascending the peaks in the spine of the world. 
I wish I had that actual loot with me, so I could be like, nee, 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 nee. But anyways, <clears throat> anyways. Beast did he battle, and darkest of holds, Bold not in his quest, Laurel conquered all. Winters came, winters went, through darkest cold night, the one pushed through. What kind of minstrel is this? In midst of this tundra place, he did mine home for the elves, Laurel did crown. Crown what? Some parts of that song did not make any sense. Like that very last verse, uh, Laurel did crown. Crown what? Did he crown himself king? Well, anyways, let's hear about the dwarves and the elves. Ah, the tales of the elves and dwarves. Eh, tis a sad one. Better bring out the tissues. And you can tell there's a hint of sarcasm in there. In times of strife against our court, a friend we found and once short and stout. United as one, our forces did fight. In battle we charged and drove the dark back. Once again, the dark what? You see, if you... Okay, let me just say this here. If anybody does any creative writing or any music writing here, try to be as descriptive as possible so that way your audience knows exactly what you're talking about. Because if you leave a part of a sentence incomplete or... How you say... Vague then your audience is not going to know what you're talking about. Anyways. We danced and we drank with victory in hand, an old enemy vanquished a new ally behind. Agreement both made to craft items of light, weapons of might, artifacts of power. And if anybody uh, wants to put in the comments, your singing sucks, go for it. Because I'm well aware. Anywho. For years upon years, a bond remained strong in times of prosperity, even in adversity. When the darkness returned and spawn, we were blind. The dwarves had betrayed us, weapons given to all kind. Okay, so there was a little bit of a rhyme right there. Okay. But you know, I gotta take a look at something here. Look at his uh, first rhyme. Let me see. Because I know some, I know sometimes rhymes go A A B B A B C B. Let me see. A, B, C, B. Okay, yeah, that that kind of works. But anyways. Knife and back, deception instead of friendship. That is what dwarves give to those of elven kind. Alright. Yes, I am off. Ugh. Thank God that's done. And this is why, ladies and gentlemen, I do not sing for a living. Well, anyways, let's continue exploring the rest of this place. I don't think there's any monsters here. Oh, it looks like I invoked the reaction here. This is another tavern here because we just came from another tavern right next door. Unless these are just dining halls. I mean, I don't know. like Link. Wait, is that a Link emoji? Wait a minute. Singing the ocarina? Or playing the ocarina, excuse me. And like I said before, if anybody wants to say, my singing sucks, go right ahead. Because like I said, I know I'm a horrible singer. I know cold resistance we're going to need a little bit later. Oh, what's this? Cone of cold. Hmm. Let me take a look at his wizard collection here. I think next time if he learns a uh, new wizard off. spell, level 5 wizard spell, I am definitely putting that in there. Because I think we're going to come across fire enemies a little bit later. 
Well, anyways, let's continue exploring here until, uh... Like I said, I don't think it matters which order we take the towers in. At least, I don't think. There's one more area that's... Well, well, thank you for the comment, but, uh... But, you know... But, you know, I gotta be honest. I do better with voice acting than I do with singing, because I think with singing here... You have to adjust your tune and your pitch a lot faster. Whereas with voice acting, you can keep the tune, the pitch and tone a little more consistent. Greetings, Sa. Welcome, welcome. Don't be taken back by all the wonderful items I have for sale. Come, come. My name is Leyland, and I'm the proprietor of this establishment. Uh, what establishment? I don't see much of an establishment here, but you know what? Surely you just saw why my store has some of the finest wares from across the land. Just look around. Look at that rug hanging on the west wall. All of this caliber can only be found from the far reaches of the east. Of course, sir. As you have probably noticed, the hand of the Seldarine is more of a fortress. We were always in constant preparation for battle against the Dark Horde of the North. As you have seen, the levels below house the majority of the Elven forces. Go on. The level you are standing on is a commons area where you find our first of all tavern and the stores of your truly me. From this level, you can obviously see the five towers that protrude from here. Corallian Tower, Severash Tower, Shen Nine Tower, Labell Tower, and Selenor Tower. Okay, so yeah, like I said before, this is our objective. And we need to know a little bit more about each. Some would call Corallian Tower the place where many, if not all of the important decisions are made regarding the Artel Kessir of the North. As of late, most of our time has been spent in preparing a defense against the Horde. Almost as if the fight was going to be taken to our front door. But fear not, sir. The Artel Kessi of the North will crush the Horde long before their feet touch this fortress. Interesting, to say the least. Okay, tell me about the Severash Tower. In Severash Tower, you will, f you will find where the armed forces of the Artel Kessi of the North train and equip themselves for battle. From blade to blow, Kalesa takes every elf and hones them to do battle with the Horde. Perhaps she can give you a few lessons as well, sir. If I cross paths with her, sure. Deep within Sehanine Tower is where we enchant the weapons and armor used against the Horde. It is one of our most heavily guarded towers to ensure that the craft as well as its items do not fall in the wrong hands. If that were to happen, it could easily turn the tide of the war against us. Huh, interesting. And this room. Yeah, you know, ever since this whole craziness began, it seems like people, uh,. Yeah, no things. Well, people have to adjust to different things here. Although I have seen some people do video conferences of uh, Dungeons and Dragons, you know, where people actually get on like Skype or Zoom or whatever, and they actually have done uh, D and D games on Skype and Zoom and all that. But I think nowadays here, uh, uh, nowadays here, people aren't doing as much. All right, let's talk about the Labellus Tower now. As you wish, uh, Labellus Tower is where the wizards of the hand spend their time if they are not busy within Sehenin Tower. Inside is one of the most extensive libraries covering elven history and lore in the realms. Located on the highest level of the tower is one of our pinnacle achievements, the Astrolab. Okay, let me explain what an Astrolab is. If I remember correctly, it is a device... I think it's like pretty much the equivalent of a telescope or something for sailors? I think. Yeah, because astrolab is not a common term. Laurel, there, Laurel and his wizards study everything regarding time and the stars. Let's see, I think that's what an astrolab is. Okay, so, let's talk about Solonar Tower now. Within this tower is where our devout priests reside. They provide various clerical services to us as well as tend to the sick and wounded. If you ever need their services, they are at your disposal, sir. Let's see what this guy has. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Hmm. This is... Kinda interesting. Hmm.
Wait, let me see that again. A barbarian can use a lute? I can only imagine the songs he would play if he was to play a lute. Oh, I slay me enemies with me sword. There's blood and gore and everything I said is my word. Oh, boy. If I ever saw a barbarian singing with a lute, I would turn the other way and run. Oh, boy. Okay, so this is all cold resistance. Answer. I gotta go take a look and see what, uh... Quickly now. Huh. Seems like all my characters... Oh, except... Huh. Seems like, uh, we're all running around barefoot. I wonder if I could buy, uh... Where'd he go? Yeah, a reasonable request. Oh, you're still right there. Okay. Hmm. Well, if I ever need anything special... You know what? Now that I think about it... I guess I could use some more fire arrows. Yeah, because, like I said, I have a feeling that we're going to need fire arrows at some point. Okay, so there's only one. Um... Hmm. Well, you know what? I'll come back to these. I, am, I shall do my best. Because like I said before, with the... With the fire arrows, we're going to need them against the ice trolls. So yeah, like I said, I don't think... I'm, I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to go clockwise. I'm going to start here. Clear this tower first. Calls me. Yeah, we're just gonna explore each room slowly. Let's see what I can learn. Dagger, that's right. What is labor calls me? Are you sure? Wow. No, not Serena! No! Leave my girl alone! Thanks for stopping by, uh, and I'll see you again. Agreed. All right. All right, so what I'm gonna have to do in this room is go in, but then just get out of there. Because that could be a little less dangerous as soon as I have to. What do you mean I can't just barge in like this? What? Hold on a minute. 
lot easier for you if we hold them back to back here there you go yeah you can see now we have fewer to deal with and my art and my range units are safe you know what i do have my haste scroll that's right put it on me Alright, now we're cooking. Bring it on. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna I have to go on best. a killing spree. I'm a busy man. I got places to go, monsters to kill. I hope I can get another haste scroll soon. That would be amazing. Go on a killing spree. <laughs> All it takes is just one haste spell, and there you go. Woo! Look at them go! Go, little guys, go! Anyways, let's see if they have anything left or anything of interest here. Well, not really. Uh, Rekha, do you mind getting out of my way? Okay, I'll get out of your way, then. Looks like I got another item I can sell. I do my best. And that takes care of this floor here. Nope, no items available. Certainly. Oh, I got I think a chance to talk to her. Hi! Have you come to play with me? I haven't had anyone to play with for so long. My name is Saria. Nice to meet you. Have you seen my mother? Mother is... Mother? She owns this place. When strangers came to the hand, mother let them rest here. Did you want to play now? Mother said there was a lot of fighting downstairs and that we should stay here. There was so much noise. When the noise got really loud, mother began to cry. She told me to hide under the bed and not let anyone in. The big bad boogeyman would have taken me away. Mother says she was going to help and that she'd come back to play with me soon. She locked the door and I haven't seen her since. That's okay. Mother is probably busy helping. She'll come back soon. Nope. After your rest, then we can play. So, yeah, like I said, this is a... Well, this is sure as heck going to take a beat a lot of traveling back to town. All right, so I think there's more rooms we have to visit. Oh, yeah, there's this room, too. I forgot about it. So, what's this room? Oh, it's like another commons. and black brew. Hmm. This could come in handy. Who's got the rest? Oh, she Oh, he does. What is your will? Right, let's see here. Oh, nothing else here of interest, so... Wait, what? Okay, so back to this tower here. So like I said, I'm going clockwise here. And like I said, this is definitely going to save me a lot of time. 
let's go up to the next Three. floor, because this floor is conquered. Uh, what do we have here? Request. Okay, so this one's not going to be as uh, easy because there's more room. Ow. Ow. Oh, you know what we could do is actually lead him downstairs. Ow. Guys. Guys. Okay, so. Oh, I'm gonna do this. Ow. You know, that's the one thing that bothers me. Why is it that the elves in the previous floor are so friendly and yet? These out here are ready to kill us. Yeah. But at least uh, he leveled up, so that's good to know. Alright, I can pick another weapon for him to be proficient in. Hmm. Oh, he's more proficient in short sword. I forgot about that. Hang on. Oh, I can't go back. I think we'll give him another sword and, sword and shield style. All right. So who's next? Hmm. Nobody is at this point. What is your will? I will do as you ask. I shall do my best. Okay, so that's two floors of uh, the Corellan Tower down. We still got a long ways to go. So yeah, yeah like I said, I think the Labellus Tower is last. A reasonable oh, request. I'm gonna search this room. A map with miniatures simulating a battle in some land. Hmm. I didn't think they were into uh, into miniatures. Value in here. Okay, looks like we got some items here. We can uh, plunder. Oh, looks like uh, well, well, all right. Looks like we got some. Uh, I wonder if this is a quest item. Yeah, it is. All right. It's a cursed item. Okay, so yeah, that's going that's gonna get sold for sure. I 
Cloud kill? Okay. Here's some more. Stone skin. Okay, yeah, that is definitely one of the best spells. According to the sense here, arguably one of the best defensive spells ever. Stone skin makes the wizard virtually immune to any cut, blow, projectile, or the like. Although spells and spell damage will still affect him as normal. The next one to four attacks, plus one attack every two levels of the caster, then strike the creature will simply bounce off with no effect. Okay, so it looks like it's only a single uh, effect and not a cumulative. Alright. Probably end up selling these scrolls. What is your I shall do my best. Whew. I suppose I got some sure. Sure. Quickly now. I am off. <laughs> I just love that. Whenever anyone's whenever anyone doubts me, I'll be like, alright, so I'm gonna be like, sure. I am off. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just off. humorous. <laughs> in my opinion. But I think I could use the gear here, if I'm not mistaken. I think I can. Yes. Certainly. Hmm. He's a broken machinery. Hmm. I am. I shall do my best. Traps are still gonna hang on to because you never know. What is a reasonable request? Like I said, I know this broken gear can be used, but for what? Labor calls me. All right, let's go explore the next floor now. Not this one, but the floor below it. Oh no, never mind. I was right. A reasonable request. No, I was wrong. Me. Okay, so let's explore Saturday. this floor now. Let's see what we get. Oh, we also got to be careful for traps. Okay. Quickly now. Not I am that off. I have any plans on us keeping any cursed items, anyways. Leave my cleric down. alone. I am ready. I will do as you ask. I'm still gonna hang on to the flame sword though. It's too useful of an item to get rid of. It's just too useful. What is your will? Quickly, I will do as you ask. Because like I said, at some point we're still gonna need a Oh, he used one up already. Okay, that's right. Well, I'm listening. What is your will? I 
I will do as you ask. I will do as you ask. Protection from lightning. Oh, it's another scroll. Okay, this statue was a symbol of beauty and I, peace. I will do as you ask. Oh, I wonder. We have to go to the other towers. I'll talk to Valestis and see what he has to say. Peace be with you. I have not seen adventurers in quite some time. I am called Valestis. Welcome to the Arboretum. I stand here and watch, hoping for the day that the plants will grow back. Okay, so that's another thing I didn't mention is that each tower you have to complete a task and in this one I have to bring water and I think with the gear I got to take it to another tower I believe but anyways I stand here and watch hoping for the day that the plants will grow back during the years of peace at the hand I cared for the arboretum I believe it's kind of like a I believe it's like a garden of some kind were for trees I believe it was a place of indescribable beauty. Now it lies in ruin. But I am patient. The day will come when life will grow here again. The serene peace we had known for many years was ultimately shattered by war. When the Dark Horde came, followed by Hordak, and Bleach, Mantena, Catra, you name it, Shadow Weaver as well, we found ourselves upon the losing side. We couldn't find the rebellion in time, and Shiro was nowhere to be found. So what happened next? While I appreciate what we fought for and the sacrifices that were made, I am not a man of war. During the last days of the fall, I remained here and watched over the Arboretum, the last chamber in the Sedrine's hand that contained any sort of peace. It was at this time that the Sedrine's hand was blanketed with a spell that doomed us all. All my life was drained, or as my life was drained from me, so was all the beauty within the Arboretum. I watched in horror as every plant and creature died before my eyes. So here is where I stand and watch, waiting for the day when life will begin anew within these halls. Perhaps you can. In your, if in your travels you would require the seeds that can flourish in the harshest of places, or perhaps come across a sample of pure water, or even any small animal seeking a new home. Okay, so this hour you need three items. Seeds, animals, and water. I would be able to return some beauty to this place. Such things no longer exist in the hand that can only be found in the rarest places in the north. All right, so I, am off. I think Sir, I might have to go back outside because there was a squirrel earlier. I will do as you ask. Um, a reasonable yeah. request. I believe. I will do as you ask. So that takes care of one tower. So we got, so we got three more to go. Oh. Yeah, we got three more towers to go. Oops. What am I doing? Okay, so. Back down here. Agreed. Yeah, because I think I saw a squirrel outside. Let me see if he's still there. I will do as you ask. And I think that gear can be used in another tower, I believe. But we'll see. Ask. I'm 
me see if he's still outside. I shall do my best. He was over here. Unless he's gone. Nope. Looks like he's gone. Okay. Um, so back inside. Okay, because I think I missed that opportunity. Unless there are animals in the other towers. I mean, we'll see. Certainly. this room. Yeah, something tells me I don't think I can, at least from this side. But we can always come back later. Yeah, it looks like it's broken off. There's no way I can get across. Agreed. So yeah, this tower is... Kalesa. There she is. Let's talk to her. Adventurers? Here in the hand of the Seldrian? You must have fought past the horde below. Battle ready, I take it. Tell me, why are you here? A noble cause. That's something my heart has yearned for. What I wouldn't give to ride once again for such causes. Well met, adventurers. My name is Kalesa. I am... was the weapons master of the hand. With that said, you must have some questions I need answering. When the hand was at the pinnacle of its glory, I trained my people in the ways of combat. No one could best my deftness with the sword, or my accuracy with the bow. All my soldiers were honed to perfection. When we were called to battle, it did not take long before our enemies found their forces in chaos and retreat. Those days are long gone now. Any of my soldiers that remain are twisted shadows of their former selves. I differ from them only in that I have retained my senses. It is a curse, knowing that but we've become powerless to do anything about it. Finding the Royale will not be easy. When the hand fell, he was damned. He is now a Belnor, an elven lich-like creature doomed to live forever. How this came about, I do not know. You may have seen Laurel as you have explored the hand, but what you saw is not only truly him. It is more ascending, a figment of himself that wanders the hand. Laurel, the true Laurel, is atop Labella's tower. Every time I have seen Laurel sending, it has rambled on like a village idiot, with one exception. Once it mentioned something about Laurel's great astrolabe and how it was no longer turning. Laurel's astrolabe is a wondrous device constructed to help him and his wizards research space and time. As I recall, Laurel and his wizards were using it during the last days of the Hand. In the aftermath, in the aftermath of the Hand's destruction, I found this piece of machinery, which I believe to be a piece of Laurel's astrolabe, 
After seeing the state of mind of most everyone left in the hand, I have held onto it and guarded it. The last thing I wanted was someone using the power held within it this piece to cause further harm to the hand. Your intentions may be noble, but I'm afraid I cannot entrust you with this item yet. You'll need to prove yourselves first. The elves atop this tower were amongst my most dedicated soldiers. Whatever curse befell the hand not only twisted their bodies, but twisted their minds as well. They act and live as if in the final moments of the hand, forever prepared to defend against any intrusion to this tower. My soldiers do not deserve what has befallen them. They deserve to die in battle. They would want to meet their end with steel in their hands upon the battlefield. I would ask that you climb the tower and send them to eternal rest. You have my heartfelt thanks. Return to me when my soldiers are at peace. Yeah, I will Before do I do that, though, I'm going to have a look around. Okay, I don't think I can enter any of these rooms yet. And lockpicking is not going to work. It is a shame that we must resort to violence. I am ready. This time, action is yours. Prepare to be destroyed. Places to go. Monsters to go. It can't Is it? Eh. What are you doing? It's not what I asked for. Too bad. Quickly now. Oh, this is may I help? Yes. Yeah, I want them to attack my uh Gonna concentrate on this tower first. I am off. Actually, second technically. Labor calls me. Luckily for us, it's right next door Certainly. to the end. Because poor Joanne, she's just getting beaten senseless.
quickly. I shall do my best. A reasonable request. A reasonable request. Oh, looks like there's some items here. All right. Okay, so we're at the top. Oh, good. Just what I don't need. Great spiders. But since I have a fire sword, yeah, defeating these guys should not be a problem. Oh yeah. I think anything magical is gonna take care of these guys. Oh yeah. Thank God I held onto this flame sword. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I lost her. No. Yes. Not Joanne. Yeah. I am ready. Agreed. Well, you know what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I got a better idea. What is your labor I think I'm just gonna. Me? I'm just gonna solo this. You guys stay put. This part right here. I will do as you ask. How about a little fireball action, boys? What is your will? Ooh, that's gotta hurt. All right, that went way better. Oh yeah. Quickly, neighbor calls me. Oh wait, what's going on with me? Oh, I'm diseased. Okay, so two of us are diseased, but fortunately though, I do have some mummy's tea, so let's end up poison. There we go. So let's drink up. Oh yeah, that's much better. Oh yeah. I am ready. A reasonable request. Oh yeah. Okay. Alright, I think best. that takes care of this tower here. And nobody died, so that's good to know. Ask. But I think I have to go to the other side now. Labor calls me. Oh, 
Luckily, we all stayed far back, so... Alright, so my rangers are in good standing. Well, that really wasn't that bad. That wasn't so bad at all, but we have to wait for the web to wear off. And we're the only ones standing in it, so... So to my uh, ranged attackers, good job. Quick, I am on. So yeah, there's a lot more. Certainly. Well, it's good to know someone stood outside the field. Yeah, go ahead, run away. Coward. Yes. Oh boy. Oh boy, I cannot see this ending very well. Probably should have had Edward, uh... I'm here. Watch me work! What? What is it? I'm here. That was close. I'll do what I can. Oof. I am definitely going back downstairs yes. and recuperating. After all that. Is there anything behind? No, of course not. Yeah, I gotta go back and get some more arrows for for Joe here. Yeah, you need me. I am ready. certainly. What is your will? Certainly. Hmm. Yes. A 
reasonable request. So sassy. Nah, what I shall do. Ready to do yeah, that's fine, I guess. Okay, so yeah, we do have to go back and start uh, uh selling some of the stuff. I will do as you ask. Oh, Stone, too. Uh, I'm at the whim of a madman. Okay, she doesn't have a helmet on either, so I wonder if I can do this. The answer is yes, I can. Magic resistance plus five, so that's not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, no, wait, she had to have this one. So much better. And no one died this time. So good for me. Quickly now. Agreed. I am off. Labor calls me. Certainly. Agreed. So I think 
this room is pretty much done. Yeah, the room's done there. Okay, we can head up to the next floor. Agreed. Oh, looks like we're in the archives now. I guess this is a bit of a safe haven of sorts here. A reasonable request. So it looks like we're in an observatory. Let's talk to Gellerith first. Blasted machine, I'll never get it fixed. Let me see. Me to the abyss. You might be right. If you find any more pieces, let me know. Otherwise, check back with me after I put the pot in. There's Laurel. I am ready. Agreed. Free my people. Astrolim. Twirls. Twirls. Free my people. Astrolim. Twirls. Twirls. All right. Um, I think if I remember correctly, you do not attack him because if you do, then I think you fail at one of the quests. I am off. Certainly. And we also have to keep an eye out for more of the pieces, which should be in the other towers because I think this one's finished. Oh, it's not bad. Not bad at all. I am off. All right, so we gotta go back downstairs. I will do as you ask. So where am I gonna find some water? It might be in one of the towers. Neighbor calls me. Okay, I think we can talk to her now. I see you have return adventurers. I thank you for helping me with my, one of my last tasks in this realm. Before I give you your reward, I would have you help me one last time. With my soldiers at rest, there is only one thing left for me to do. To join them. I would ask for the honor of dying in battle. Let's dance. Okay, then. Quickly now. Well. That was interesting, to say the least. Oh, okay, we can take this back to the Astrolab as well. Great. Ring, hide in shadows. I guess he can put it to use. Now he's got a pair of boots too. Yes. Boots of speed. Okay, so who's the slowpoke of the group? If I can find any.
quickly agreed. <laughs> Takes care of two tasks now. Whew. A reasonable request. Well, actually, you know what? Hang on, I got a better idea. Before I do that, I'm gonna take care of one last piece of business. Agreed. I am off. You are off, all right. Certainly that you have the boots of speed. I will do as you ask. Labor calls me. Labor calls me. Will do as you ask. I am off. Got another piece for you. Let me see. Well, send me to the abyss. Right, that's two. I will do as you ask. Oh yeah, that's right. He was uh Please. taking time to uh Agreed. put the pieces together. Right, so we're uh, reasonable request. We're making some really good progress now. I am off. A reasonable request. <sighs> All right, making some real progress here today, folks. Like I said, despite a rough start, at least uh, things are going much smoother now. I will do as you ask. Certainly. All right, so that's technically three towers down, two to go. The only thing this guy doesn't have is potion, so if I need some more, I'm gonna have to go back to town. Oh, I'm gonna get her some more bullets too. Oh. What is it? anymore, nor this. Yeah. Although I said, I highly doubt she's gonna need the, uh, uh daggers. It's not gonna make more room for arrows. Alright. I shall do my best.
All right. I think that's going to do it for this session here. Um, thank you to those who watched. Thank you to those who joined me in the chat. I will see you all next time.